What's going on guys? Asianized White Dragon here. So uh, we're going to be doing some more uh, spectating commentary here. So uh, our opponent just activated duality. I believe he added a D prison. Uh, it was... Oh, okay. Thunder King and Skill Drain, all in one. Oh, I hope he's got Starlight Road. Oh, I think he does have Starlight Road. Either that or he has Solemn Judgment in that case that uh, does kind of... Uh, Stop that too. Ooh, upstart. So uh, let's see what these guys are. Their rating is fourteen hundred, and we got another fourteen hundred. So this guy's ahead by one point. He beats the guy's name that is number one. But uh, might be an exotic deck. Oh no, wind ups. Hmm. I understand. I know wind-ups are pretty popular, but I didn't think people ran uh, wind-up rabbit because like it's not really used for like the whole loop thing. Oh, wait. one minute. He's gonna chain because he does have to target, you know. Uh -oh. He can chain MST, but then again, he did gain a thousand life for free. Uh, so that's pretty good stuff. Solid judgment. Now I believe it's. I'm not sure if it's a uh, a cause. Like to banish it. Um, yeah, I'm not sure. But if anyone knows, let me know in the comment section below because I honestly have no idea if Wind Up Rabbit is a cause. Oh, it's cool. He still saw. <laughs> he still gets rid of it. <laughs> yeah. Now I don't know if he can still banish it because it. I guess it is during either player's turn, so it wouldn't really matter. And it doesn't say once per turn, so yeah, okay, never mind. But uh, I was thinking, if it only said like once per turn, then maybe he couldn't. I'm not sure though. Um, so yeah, our poor wind up player over here. I don't think he has much chance against Thunder King. Unless he could sack for Caius right now. Okay. Werewolf. Oh, that's pretty interesting. Oh, that's an interesting way to w run out Werewolf in uh, the wind ups, because you can just spot him. That's pretty cool. I don't understand this play uh, because anything he XYZ is for, Thunder King can just say no. Um, obviously, Zen Mings? Well, I, I mean, anything he goes for is really just going to go away. Uh, maybe he has like a Reborn. Oh, I asked Golem. Um, but I believe there's a D Prison on the field. Uh, from the very beginning. So I don't understand the point of that. Because <laughs> obviously, okay, so this is one thing you have to note with Thunder King. Um, if your opponent has Thunder King and they don't negate your special summon, I'm pretty sure they have an a answer to what you're doing. So there really wasn't any point in time. I don't understand why he waited for Mean Phase 2. <laughs> it didn't make sense to me because, like, if he's going to go for that play, why not just go for, um, uh, I guess he go for Zen Mink now and that wouldn't really matter, but then he still has to deal with Thunder King. <laughs> and Thunder King can just negate this. <laughs> it's cool, he'll have Solemn. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, Thunder King's just too good. I don't know, what do you guys think? Do you think Thunder King will get hit by, uh, a list? Cause I mean he is good card, um, but I mean he's anti meta. But then again, like since they touched oppression, which I was super surprised about, since it was anti meta and oppression wasn't topping at all. Uh, I mean like Black Wings did run it, but like yeah, I really didn't think it deserved a ban, especially when MST's at three. That just makes no sense. Duality, add duality. <laughs> but yeah, skill drain really does hurt. Uh, the uh, the wind up it hurts a lot of decks actually. Um, Thunder King can still tribute. Oh, he's going for bottomless. I mean, most of the stuff he's gonna X Y Z for because he is like an X Y Z deck. I I think I would add duality. I mean, if my opponent has you know, 
one card. I think duality would have been a better option here. Oh, okay, so he already has a monster you can summon. So. And all the TG effects actually in the graveyard. So I guess it is TGs versus windup TGs. Shuffling for the duality, because he forgets too. Just like Asian Eyes White Dragon. He let him go to defense. Like, first of all, he has to activate this. Um. Uh, there's too much advantage right now for the TG player over here, our player in blue. I think he's gonna seal the deal on this game! Unless he can pull out a Dark Hole and then summon Thunder King. Oh, heavy Storm, that's a good card. <laughs> So yeah, there, there probably isn't any back row just because obviously the Solemn Judgment was the answer to that. Uh, but the thing is, like, it doesn't matter at this point because our opponent here can search out what? Eight, eight, wow, well, it's kind of confusing in life. It's okay. I guess our opponent here can't do math, <laughs> just like Ace Nice White Dragon again. <laughs> um, it doesn't matter because he can search out Rush Rhino and run over that. I'm pretty sure he's going to search out Rush Rhino. Unless he happens to have him in his hand, in that case it doesn't matter anyways. <laughs> oh, oh, he did add Rush Rhino. I mean, he could have added, like, Striker if he really wanted, like, Synchro or... I mean, some TG players do run uh, Mind Control, just because it, it's really good to XYZ with other people's Xanga, just so they don't get the effect. But our opponent... Our, I keep on calling it my opponent, because I'm still, like, looking at it from the perspective that uh, I'm like the red player on the bottom, but yeah. So it's Heavy Storm is gone, and that way the windups can't get their like loop effect. Um, let's see, it's a windup magician. Rush Rhino is so good at that 2000. He pretty much needs an answer like right now. And I think that RTG player can answer. Oh, he's removing. Oh, I was like, what? Room MST? That's pretty interesting, I guess. Um, another spell strike? <laughs> Intense. Um. I don't think I'd <coughs> go for Zen mains. Just because, what are you gonna do with Zen mains? <laughs> Especially with that much back row, anyways. Uh, I mean, they should have an answer, yeah. Um, oh, you can't, I forgot, you can't levy up for Acid Golem just because Acid Golem doesn't have a level. So I was gonna say, you should have went for Acid Golem. Um, <coughs> Well, I mean, Levier to get back to Azul. But yeah, I don't think there's really anything he could have done. Um, any mistakes I thought he made? I don't think there was really any mistakes. It's just because the guy opened up with uh, Thunder King plus like the Solemn Judgment really did hurt uh, the player number one there. But if there's anything that you think that he could have done better, let me know in the comment section below. I, I really don't think there's anything he could have done. But uh, thanks for watching, guys. Asian Ice White Dragon, signing out.